This hearing lasted less than 30 minutes and when the federal judge asked Congressman Fortenberry how he pleads, he said not guilty. Fortenberry faces federal criminal charges, including lying to FBI agents who were asking him about foreign cash that ended up in his 2016 reelection campaign. His attorney argued for no bond, saying the eight term Republican should be free on his own recognizance. Quote, this is a respected member of Congress. He has to go to trial. He has to defend this case. But the judge sided with prosecutors ordering a $50,000 bond and no contact with witnesses in the case for Fortenberry, including the African billionaire who the feds say funneled the foreign money through others to the congressman at an L.A. fundraiser. The defense lawyer also admitted in court today that the phone call at the center of this case between a fundraiser and Fortenberry was recorded. It's in that 2018 call that federal prosecutors say Fortenberry learned the campaign cash he got in 2016 was from overseas. They say after learning that Fortenberry did not file amended reports with the Federal Election Commission and lied to FBI agents about it in 2019 when they came to ask questions. Fortenberry denies lying to the FBI. Fortenberry's attorney slammed the case. Prosecutors are laying out and indicated he plans to file a flurry of motions in the case in pretty short order. One asking the court to dismiss the case outright. Another asking to have the case moved from California to Nebraska or Washington, D.C. We'll track all of that as it happens in this public corruption case.